Okay, team. That's everyone. Let's get out of here. Activate the pattern enhancers. I've got the ISO DZ. Let's do it. What? Over here. Oh. <laughs> Where's the ISO gun, dog? Did they actually just steal it? Oh no. Oh my god. He's dead. Yeah, obviously, Carol. Monroe to Voyager. Four to beam back. So, did they take the isodesium? Is that what their whole gig was? Just show up. Thanks for this. Later. I feel like the Borg have enough Borgs to just do it themselves. Why do they wait for us? That's kind of mean. You spawn capped, bro. No tactical insertions. Sir, two of them are wounded. It's Lathrop and Odell. Beam the wounded directly to sickbay. Where is Lieutenant Foster? Would you mind explaining exactly what happened? It... it was the Borg, sir. When we activated the pattern enhancers, they must have been able to beam in. They took mm. Foster and the Isodesium. They caught us completely by surprise. They were in and out before we could even react. Ms. Murphy, you are dismissed. Dang, I'm in trouble. Prevent the Borg from taking the Isodesium? Sir, I didn't want to take the chance I might hit Foster. That is a chance you should have taken, Mr. Monroe. I'll beat what? you up. There is such a thing as acceptable losses. Had you fired, it is likely that the Borg would not have the isodesium we need. And Foster might be dead. Possibly. But your emotional decision may have cost the lives of every member of this crew. Perhaps next time, you will consider this. Prepare a full report. I will summon you when we determine what action to take. Bro, what kind of weird ship is this, dog? What do you mean, decision to take? There is no decision to take. I didn't shoot. Therefore, you must get over it. And start thinking of a new plan. Punishing me is not going to do absolutely anything in this instance. Punishing me will just get basically just minus one debuff on the crew. Man, this sucks. Yeah, it does. Yeah. Rick, relax. Relax, those Borg killed Ken. I'm gonna go over there and personally break every one of their grimy necks with my own bare hands. Yeah, I don't. Oh, what up? We're over there, right? We gotta teach them not to mess with Starfleet for Ken. Rick, look, we can't just go over to a Borg ship for revenge. We. Yeah, yeah. Well, what about Foster, huh? He might still be alive. We gotta save him. That's facts, though. Probably assimilated him already. We can get him. We're a professionally trained hazard team. We'll get him back and give him some for Ken. I'm actually pretty excited that we're gonna go have to fight the Borg now. Oh, I don't think I, I don't think this is where I'm supposed to be. But I am excited about it. Where am I supposed to go? I've been working on Seven Zymon. It's coming along. Should be ready for field use pretty soon. Cool. Sorry, Monroe. Holodex offline right now. All right, we came from here. This is where we came from. I think this is the last place we're missing. I just don't believe there was nothing they could do, sir. Am I interrupting something? Yeah. Can I speak freely? Go ahead. Honestly, Lamo, I don't know how it could have gone so poorly. Ken, Foster, Odell, and we lost the Isodesium. What are you trying to say? I'm saying someone must be to blame. That's all. What up, Kent? You trying to say something, dog? Shoot both of you. You have some buttholes. I heard Odell's gonna make it. The doc says he got to him just in time. Good thing you found him. What you got to say, huh? I'm on your table. Hmm. 
I think I talked to everyone. Sure. Yeah. I'm sorry, but I don't have time to talk now. Alright, well shut up. I'm gonna talk to him then. Hey. Yeah. Okay. Mitch. One thing I don't understand, why would the Borg take Foster and the Isodesium in the first place? Who knows? I just hope we can get them back. I'm sure Foster is a cool guy. I hope they're sending us over there. I know we can get Foster and the Isodesium back. Hmm. Who wouldn't want Foster, right? It just makes sense to me. Why would you not want Foster? Can I talk to you, big dog? Brian, can I help you? No. What up, but but Brian? How you looking? How you feeling? Chill. I don't know what we were thinking. We we weren't ready for this. This is crazy. We're dead in space. We're, we're not gonna make it out of here. Crewman, get a hold of yourself. We'll make it. If you say so, Monroe. Yeah, bro, chill out. Rick. Don't talk to me, Monroe. I'm wound up. <laughs> I'm a quantum torpedo ready to blow, man. Maybe you should go to the holodeck and blow off some steam, Rick. Nah, I'm saving it all up for the Borg. Yeah, that's not how emotions work, but fair enough. Tells you. Tuvok to Monroe. Alex. Report to Astrometrics no, immediately. If you're blaming yourself, don't. None of us saw it coming. I'm not blaming myself in the slightest, actually, so thank you for that. Alright, where's the turbo lift? Where is the turbo lift? It's over here, right? Is it this one? It's one of these down here, right? Nope. Nope, is it this one? Oh, what up, Captain, you absolute butthole? What do you want? Bro, I'm about to smack him up right in this elevator, dude. Astrometrics. What you got to say, huh? Foster's alive. We can still save him. That is a possibility. You may well have the chance to find out. What? Though it goes against my better judgment, you are next in line for command of the hazard team. We are going to infiltrate the Borg Cube. My favorite place of all time. You love to see it. Ensign? Sup? I take it you know Seven and Ensign Kim. Seven and I were Why are you wearing something so tight? And we've located a Borg Cube here in the we're in space, forces. dog. Come on. The vessel appears to be heavily damaged. Monroe, you and the hazard team are going to beam over there and get back the isodesium. Let's go, dude. And Foster? Safe. Ensign, we're not even sure he's still alive, but if it's possible to rescue him, then yes, by all means. But the isodesium is of the highest priority. Seven will be joining you on this mission. And Ensign, you are now officially in command of the hazard team. Yes, sir. You mean ma'am? Seven has prepared a plan of action. All right, seven. Let's go, dude. Since we don't know where the Borg may be storing the isodesium, I've chosen a beam in point within reasonable proximity to a primary sub-processing matrix. From there, I should be able to determine the exact location of the isodesium. Why not beam directly to the matrix? We do not wish to alert the Borg. The beam in point is in an area of low importance. There is also an assimilation chamber en route. It is possible that Lieutenant Foster is as yet unassimilated and being held there. Hopefully, they'll be too busy repairing their ship to worry about a few trespassers. Sounds good. Get in there. Get the isodesium. And rescue Foster if Dude, you can. Dude, the whole idea of being yes. assimilated is, like, almost terrifying. Actually getting yourself chopped up, you know, bionicle things put inside of you, and then... I will join you and your team in Join the hive mind. Alright. You're close Monroe. that tight. I trust your performance will surpass your previous efforts. Everyone's up in here dressing modestly, and she's just like, Yep, bodysuit. Hey, <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's the one. 
Once we have the isodesium, we beam straight back here. Any questions? Mm, nope. Yeah. Why aren't I on this mission? If we're gonna dumb. get to work some payback, you're gonna need some extra manpower. This isn't a revenge mission, Rick. Our mission is to get the isodesium back. And rescue Foster. If possible, yes. As for firepower, Seven's Infinity Modulator prototype is ready for field testing. Ah, there you go. Normal clothing. Nasty. We'll be more than ready for them. It is unwise to underestimate the Borg. It's fact. Yeah, see? You're gonna need me to help eliminate some Borg. Uh, no offense, man. None taken. Beesman, I know you're upset about Ken and Foster, but killing a bunch of Borg isn't gonna bring them back. I need cool heads. You're gonna have to learn to control yourself before I can assign you to another mission. Dismissed. Monroe, c come on! I said dismissed. Oh, you're loving this, aren't you? It is true, though, like... If there are no further delays... He's acting very emotionally, and that's all well and good, but... One little mistake and all just all of us could die, so... You know, being emotional is, like, natural. But, you know, he sees one Borg, he has a quick trigger finger, and all of a sudden, oh, we've got a hundred Borg, and now we're all Borgs. Doing Borg things, living the Borg life. I don't feel like doing that, dude. I feel like the breath of the Borg is probably gross. Probably stinks. I couldn't live that way. Alright. Let's go ahead and save it up. We're finally in my... Favorite place on the entire planet, right. the Borg. Just yourselves, and they should ignore us. This isn't a simulation, so stay sharp. Can I not shoot them, even if I wanted to? I, cause I kind of want to shoot them. Man, that blank stare. I can't tell what they're thinking. They're not. One of them is thinking the queen of this whole thing. Just one is thinking. The rest of these guys are just chilling. Doing their thing. Don't mind me, I'm just borging about. Wow, this place is huge. Look out! What are you doing? Sir, he's coming right out of No, no, no. He's fine. He's chilling. Don't worry about him. The high security force field. I shall attempt to override it. Thanks. Do that, please. This terminal is malfunctioning. Crewman Chang, take out that generator. Ooh. Take cover. Bomb. <laughs> Yo, we got all the weapons. Look at that. Scavenger, stasis, grenade. Oh shoot, they're everywhere. Where are you shooting from? Great. How about you not start walking towards me, huh? Yo, there's... Oh, is he assimilated? I feel like I see an eyepiece. I feel like he's been pieced up. Look, it's Foster. We have to save him. I detect no controls or power source for this force field. I would advise against taking unnecessary risks. Unnecessary? But no, we can't just leave him behind like this. Our primary objective is of utmost importance. We cannot endanger our mission. Borg already consider us hostile, and Lieutenant Foster is most likely beyond help. Monroe, please. This is your chance to make things right. Tell me we're going to rescue Foster. Yeah, I'm cool going to get Foster. What's up? Monroe, please. Do something. What are you doing? Alex, it's just... Bro, 
We're obviously going to say Foster. Come on, guys. Oh, what's up? Don't mind me. I'm just working about. Well, both of you just shut shut up, like, right now, huh? Oh. It's not too late, though. Also, it's not your decision. I'm captain. Yo, where's the dude? You have endangered our mission, Ensign. Bro, you should your best for now. We must continue with our mission to retrieve the Isodesia. Where's the guy? Where'd the guy go? I am much confusion. Okay. I need you guys to stop existing. Oh, what up? Bro, you want to get out of my shot, big guy? You gonna? I gotta do everything for you guys. Come on. I gotta hold you guys' hands everywhere I go. I don't. I don't hold you guys for one second. All of a sudden, you just get captured by something. Oh wait, I'll take energy. This looks safe. Well, then you shoot. If they wake up. It's usually how. Oh, what up? How many are there? Twenty. But. Anyone else want some? Nelson, Nelson, get back up. Nelson. Who is Nelson? He's hurt by Evan Rowe. He's got to be out. S sorry, sir. Get back to the ship, Nelson. Yes, sir. Later, Nelson. You weenie. There's another one. Why'd you go and get shot like that, bro? New area. New part of the cube. You'll love to see it. Alright, what part of the Borg cube are we going to next, huh? Save game? Yes. Please, I feel like this... I'm gonna die around here at some point. I'm gonna fall fall off something. Out, slow down. Let me slow down. I'm always Stay fast. Here and watch for more you don't even. And I will scout ahead. You don't even know Sir. how fast I really am, bro. Y'all are slow. I'm like Sonic. Just move it. Just like to move it, move it. Give me health, please. Okay. Oh, I don't need more energy. I need to get past this door. Okay. Well, then, do you want to take care of it? Tight pants. That sucks for you, dog. Or wait, is that me? There's too many of them. And start shooting. I'm shooting at the board, you goofball. Well, you want to step out of the way? We'll just spawn camp them. Easy. We can't hold them. Yeah, we can. Bro, stop getting in my way. Friendly fire, dude. You ever heard of it? Ouch. Bop, bop. Dude, I'm about to run out of ammo. Um, I need this. Wait, can I shoot him with this? Nope, okay, I need more energy. Oh, what up? Oh, 
crying. I just ran out of ammo right quick, you feel? Are you gonna help the- Oh my- My teammates are actual go- Dunce- Dunces, dude. I can't even say- I can't even speak, I'm so angry. Let's go. You guys just let a Borg walk up right up to her. What are you guys doing? Come on, man. You guys just staring at it? Oh, look at that Borg. Ho, ho, ho. Come on, man. Where's your noodles at? Use your- Use that big old chunk of brain that's chilling up in your dome. Do something about it. Save? Yes. It's going to save it right up. Okay. Which way? Either will suffice. Either will suffice. Well, then I choose this way. Ooh. Ouchie. I'll well, take a little bit of health. You guys want to back up? Back it right up. Um, okay, so I know I've been doing a terrible job of commentary. <sighs> if you guys are watching this video, I recommend you go and watch the Star Trek movie with the Borgs. It's a pretty neat movie, if I say so myself. Oh, why is that dude got like darker armor? Is he like an advanced Borg? Oh, that guy's got gold armor. Some of these guys are actually like iced out. So yeah, I recommend it. Go watch the Star Trek. Again, I'm not a big Star Trek fan, but specifically when it comes to the Borg, I think it is really, really cool. It's a really cool villain. Just everything about the Borg, I just find extremely fascinating. Um, I almost like want to become like a... Austin. Star Trek nerd just based on the fact that I just like the Borg so much. Just as a concept, as a villain, I just think it's really, really cool. Mm, can I go through these doors? No. Hmm. <gasps> oh, right here. Yes, okay. I did miss something. Oh, I just hit this thing. Did I turn off the door? Sick. Let's run back out. Hmm. Left or right? Left or right? Oh, well, it takes. Actually, I'm actually full on health. Never mind. Hmm. Oh, that's not very nice. Are they behind us too? But where are all y'all just coming from? Okay. Elevator switch. Come on, jump on, boyos. We're going on a trip. In our favorite rocket ship. Falling to our deaths. Whoopsies. Yo, that board was built, not gonna lie. He must do... He must go to the gym. The Borg gym. So if one Borg goes to the gym, do all the Borgs go to the gym? Since they're like kind of a hive mind thing? Oh, you good? How about you not be good? How about that? Energy? You know I need some energy. I will never say no to a big pint of the good stuff. The chug jug juice, you feel? Alright, get in, you absolute goofball. Or jump down to your death at least. Like seven at least. Maybe five. Pew, pew, pew. This like slightly reminds me of Nazi zombies, not gonna lie.
Man, I haven't taken these headphones off in like hours.